everyone, my name is Ben and I'm a deep sky astrophotographer based in the UK. In this video we're going to be using my 14 inch Dobsonian to capture a high resolution photo of Saturn. Stick around to see how it goes, see the live capture and the final image. Welcome back to Bebro Astro, and yes, it's that time again. We've got the 14 inch Dobsonian back out and I cannot wait to use it. Every time I use this telescope, it's an amazing session. Be it visual or imaging, I'm always amazed at what I can see and capture with this telescope. It's just so much fun using such a big scope and I know these things are expensive and heavy, but if you ever get the opportunity to look through one, definitely take up that decision and opportunity. Visually, what you can see through this is incredible, but imaging is just next level. You cannot be big aperture. So in the last video where I captured the planets, I was using a slightly unorthodox setup. I was using a 533 deep sky camera with a two times Barlow that gets bundled with these telescopes. Since the last time I photographed Saturn, it's much higher in the sky and the conditions are looking a lot better and I've also changed my imaging setup since then. So let's have a look at this new imaging setup and the changes I've made. The 533 is a really great camera, but it's not perfect for doing planetary imaging with this new setup. So since then, I've replaced it with this guy, the 585MC. The IMX 585 sensor is incredible. It's using Starvis 2 technology up from the original Starvis technology that's in the 2600 and the 533 sensors. But also, this is a much better match for the new 14-inch Dobsonian. And a really big change is this guy. This is the stock 2 times Barlow you get with a lot of telescopes. This has done me amazing for a few years. It's visually, it's pretty much fine. And for imaging, it would get you really good images to get you going. But this thing is way, way better. Introducing my brand new Teleview 3 times Barlow. And this thing is a beauty. If like me you're interested in seeing how the Teleview 3x Barlow fares against one of the most basic Barlows, hit the subscribe button and I'm going to be doing a comparison comparing these two. So tonight is a moonless night which is a rare treat for us imagers in the UK. Moonless and clear skies are something to never take for granted. So I'm not just going to be using the 14 inch Dob, I'm also going to be using my 8 inch 200p Newtonian and I'm going to be capturing some luminance data on the ghost of Cassiopeia to really finish that image up. So stay tuned and I'll have a finished photo in my community page on my channel. So the sun is setting and the night is starting to roll in. Let's see how the 585 performs with the brand new Teleview 3x Barlow. So here we're looking at a live view of Saturn through my iPhone 15 connected to this telescope. This footage you're watching was from a live stream I was doing on TikTok that evening. These views are just absolutely mind blowing. Yeah, look at, look at those rings on Saturn, it's crazy. In the future, we're gonna be having a look, a close up of Jupiter, we'll be able to see its bands its moons, maybe even the Great Red Spot. So if you like the idea of viewing Saturn and Jupiter and other planets up close, hit the follow button and we'll be checking those out in the future. Yeah, this is mega, isn't it? The views tonight are just incredible. 
The conditions are unreal. Look at the detail. So as you could see on stream, the conditions were really good. I was so excited and couldn't wait to get my astronomy camera and the new Teleview Barlow in. Let's see how the end image comes out. I'm sure it's going to be my best image yet. If you feel inspired to take your own photos, links will be in the description below to all the equipment used in this video. So here we go, the final image is coming up. Thank you all so much for getting this far in the video and I really hope you've enjoyed it. Photography can be a real test of patience, but when the clouds clear and the skies open, it is always worth it in the end. Saturn is one of the main reasons I got excited about astronomy as a child. To finally have my own high resolution image of that planet is just incredible. I actually never thought I would have a photo like the one you've just seen. I really hope you've enjoyed watching this video and if you like space consider subscribing and you can see more future videos and get notified if you hit the little bell notification down below. And as always my name's Ben You've been watching Bebo Rastro and remember to keep looking up. <laughs>